So let's say that now we're at the end of the sprint. So let's talk about how you as the scrum master complete the sprint in JIRA. So you see this button right here at the upper right, complete sprint. So you click on complete sprint and it's going to give you a nice little report. It says three issues were done, one was incomplete. Tell me where all the incomplete issues should be moved. And the default is move it to a new sprint. So I usually just do that and then a new sprint is created, but you can just dump it back in your backlog. And now I'm going to uh, just click on complete. And it gives me a really nice image here of a burn down chart. And this was the planned burn down over five days in gray. And the reason that the red goes straight down is because I completed all of those within a few minutes and not over five days. If, I'd, if the team had completed them over five days, the red would um, go over five days. Um, and then at the bottom, we have what JIRA is calling a status report. So it's telling us um, what issues were completed, what type were they, they were story type, priority, status, and how many points. So that's kind of nice.